You okay, Ryuki? All right, let's keep going. Next question. In Indian mythology, what is the name of the half-god, half-beast spirits that imbibe sense and are known for their musical ability? Just press the button already. You see that button on the table, right? Push it and you get to answer the question. What? You're joking, right? What are you talking about? In Indian mythology, what is the name of the hat that imbibes scent? If you know the answer, <laughs> you feel it all right there, Mr. Ryuki? Look like what? Ah, how about this? In Indian with that in now remember it's that That's the answer button for the quiz. Why don't you press it? Toma, you mean this button? Yeah. You'd better hurry, or the other teams are going to answer before you. There we go. Team Popo was the quickest. And your answer is... That is correct. The answer is Gandharva. Team Popo gets 10 points for the correct answer. Good job, Ryu. Oh. Okay, let's keep going then, shall we? Next question. Are you familiar with the new Cyclops serial killings? Uh, what? No, no, not you, Mr. Ryuki. This question. Is for that person on the other side. Who, who was that? Yes. Yes. You think so? Seems like a normal quiz to me. The questions in this quiz aren't aimed at you, Ryu. They're for you, on the other side. I don't understand what you're saying. This is the Faith to Face Special, a six hour quiz show live stream marathon. Have you forgotten? Hurry now, your answer. The question is whether or not you're familiar with the new Cyclops series. Easy, right?
when Team Popo presses the button. You must be... Ah, but before you did... I want you to take this question very seriously. The new Cyclops serial killers. The incident in which many victims got their eye gouged out and murdered. Are you or are you not familiar with it? This is the to if we can dig into the details of that incident in the coming six days. In other words, we're asking if we can give you spoilers for the first game. But don't worry. Even if you don't know anything about it, it won't affect how you progress through this game. The Sarkoff serial killers and what you're about to experience? They have nothing to do with each other. Promise. So please, just tell me honestly, are you familiar with the new Cyclops serial killer? Thank you. I'm glad you answered truthfully. There are all sorts of things in this world you're better off not knowing after all. Oh! Did you hear that? That means the next... Are you ready? A precognitive dream is a dream that lets you see the future. But these precog... Are they really, truly real? It can't be. What's wrong? Are you okay? Are you okay? Be careful, Mizuki. I've detected a biological response. Three o'clock, distance of 315 feet, in the middle row of seats. Stranger, if they announce their intentions first. Who's the target? 
Where are they? It's too dark and they're too far away. Calm down, Mizuki. You can use my functions. Functions? Remember your training? Oh, right. Iva, zoom in. Night vision mode. Roger that. Use the X-ray next. Understood. Found you. Who is that? Identity unknown. Judging from their figure, they appear to be female. Ah, so she's jealous, huh? I bet that's it. Why else would another girl target me? You can't think of any other reason? Well, sure, but I'm really cute, you know? That's why other girls don't like me much. I am fairly certain that has more to do with your personality. Mizuki, load Evolver with a stun grenade round. You should be able to knock your opponent unconscious by detonating it near them. Got it. Okay, it's ready. I will display the aiming reticle. Take aim and pull on it. What's with this girl? Now. Detecting the target's footsteps. They seem to be heading toward the stadium exit. Ugh. Can't let them get away! Mizuki, wait. Even you won't be able to catch up to them. More importantly... There's... something there. Yes. Hey, that's... You recognize him? Yeah, I'm sure of it. I'll never forget. It's... The left half of his body. His name is Jin Furue. I remember it clearly. Six years ago, at Studio Devaita. The... Right half of his body. Ryuki, what's wrong? Pull yourself together. Boss, where am I? 
Don't tell me you were sleeping. Who falls asleep in the middle of a live stream? Yuki, you're working under Boss, right? Boss, have you been giving him vacation time? She's probably working him to the bone on his off hours, too. I resent that. That is not true. I just have him scrape the straight and corneum off my heels every once in a while. <laughs> hey, Ryuki. Are you sure you're alright? Oh, um, yeah. Alright, now that Mr. Ryuki is awake, let's get back to it, shall we? Here we go, next question. Which Taoist symbol, shaped like interlocking black and white commas, represents the origin of all things? What the? A blackout? What are you standing around for? Get the lights! Yeah, I'm on it! It's snowing, but it hasn't piled up yet. Yeah. By the way, Mizuki, there is something that has been bothering me. What's this? This is the field before law enforcement arrived. Notice anything peculiar? No, nothing in particular. The turf runs a considerable distance and is wet from the snow. If someone were to step on it, they would leave a trace. However... There aren't any footprints. Indeed. Then how did the body... Unknown. Perhaps they descended from the sky. Or rose up from the ground. Or... They teleported here. Teleported? I was joking. Do not take it seriously. Nah, the lining has eating wires in it, so I'm warm. Oh, thank you for the cons- Oh, no. I just started investigating, really. Weird, though, isn't it? He got killed six years ago, but the body shows up now? You do know I'm the commander of this, right? Right, but that's why I'm asking. Isn't it a bit weird for you to be at a crime scene in person? 
This case is special. I saw it too, six years ago. The up at Studio Devita. And the HB case is still open, even after all this time. The reputation of the whole department hangs on this case. By HB case, she is referring to the half-body serial killings. So named because the victim's bodies were cut in two. The culprit is known as Terror. Their identity is unknown. Six years have passed since Terror first made themselves known, but we have yet to find any promising leads. I already know that. You don't have to explain it. Of course. Not. What? Why not? Because you're only 18, Mizuki. You're still a student at Sekiba High. But I barely even go now. I graduate in a month. I hardly have any classes left. The point is, you're still a student. Then why did you let me join Abyss? Because I thought you had potential as a sinker. I assume your gargantuan strength and combat ability were a factor as well. But you're basically still an intern. You've only been training for about a month. It's way too early to put you in the field. Ugh, <sighs> yeah, I thought you'd say that. Please, boss. I have to. This case is... Can you not give me the puppy dog eyes? You know I'm weak to the puppy dog eyes. <sighs> Fine. But promise me one thing. Swear to me that you won't do anything dangerous or illegal, no matter what. Yeah, I swear, I swear. And one more thing. I am your superior. You should address me with a little more respect. Ten four, boss man. I read you loud and clear. Do you? Why? What is it? Well, I was just wondering if he contacted you or anything. I would have let you know right away if he did. Date was caught in that explosion six years ago. And has been missing ever since. Date's body was never recovered from the scene. Don't worry. I am positive it would take more than that to kill Kaname Date. I am certain he's at the Hot Springs District in Atami or someplace, spending his time in leisure. If he is, I'd go down there and drown him in that boiling water myself. What? You really don't know? I'm Detective Ushidera, Special Investigations Office, MPD. I don't even have to ask about you. You're Mizuki Okira, 18 years old. A high schooler attending Sekiba High. The all-girls school, right? Ah, but Okira is your former name. You've been adopted by Date, if I remember correctly. You were at the studio when the other half of the corpse was found. So I take it you were there too? Yeah. Back then I was on the investigation team. Though you were 12 at the time, so I can't blame you for not remembering me. I heard you became a special agent at Abyss. That boss lady got her claws in you, huh? This little girl gets hired as an investigator. Huh. Guess they'll take anyone they can get. Times sure have changed. Abyss is a particularly special organization. Mizuki was hired via what might be referred to as extra-legal measures. I should be asking you. You're the one who discovered the body, right? You were also at the studio six years ago when the other half was found. Quite a coincidence, don't you think? 
What are you trying to say? Why did you come here? I got a Nile message. It said, HB Stadium. That could only be referring to the case six years ago. The half-body serial killings. I need to know more about that case. It changed my life. So that's why I came. Who sent the message? I don't know. It was sent from an account that signed up with a fake name. Someone must have wanted me to discover the body. Someone? Maybe the culprit. Why would the culprit do that to you? I... don't know. There is one more thing we don't know. The masked woman who shot at us earlier. Who could this person of interest be? And why did she try to kill you? Haven't found anything yet, though there is something I didn't find that's particularly interesting. A footprint? Bingo. There isn't a single footprint on the field that doesn't belong to someone here. So just how did the culprit do it? Of course, ma'am. It's Jin Furaway. I don't think there's anyone in our generation who wouldn't recognize him. He was famous until he passed away. Well, even after he died. And six years ago, I was part of that investigation, too. Were you at the studio by any chance? You don't remember? We did talk for a bit. Um, sorry, don't re You don't leave much of an impression. In a good way. In a good way? Abyss is a high-level organization in the police department. You do technically outrank me, ma'am. Huh. Really? But you don't need to worry about the formalities with me. What? For real? I can be casual with you? Do you want to get your ass kicked? Sorry. Uh, sorry, ma'am. I've finished gathering DNA samples. It's being sent to forensics now. I'm sure the results will be out shortly. Wow, I'm honored that you'd ask. My name is Kagami. Hmm. Kagami, huh? It's nice to meet you, Kagami. It's Kagami. Kagami. I told you it's Kagami! Hey. Hey! Hello? I know you can hear me, Kagami. So you do know my name. I will get the more shocking facts out of the way first. The estimated time of death is approximately nine hours ago. What? Nine hours ago? It is currently nine o'clock. So that would mean he was killed around 12. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Six years ago, I... Hold that thought. There's more. As you can see, the body was cut in two. There are no other external wounds on the body. It appears that he was sliced in half while he was still alive. As for what was used to cut him, I am sorry, but that cannot be determined. What do you mean? Judging by the cross section, it is clear that it was not a blade. It could not be a laser or pressurized water either. Then what was it? As I said, I do not know. The body was cut at the molecular level. There is hardly any blood left in the body. It could be speculated that the corpse was left with the cut section facing the ground. However, there are no traces of any blood flow on the ground. Therefore, it is clear that he was murdered at some other location. Would you like to check the corpse with x-ray mode? Yeah. It's unlikely, but maybe the right half of the body is buried in the ground. You could simply flip the body over. No way. I don't want to see that cut. Especially not down there. Hmm. In that case, how's this? Thanks. I see now. That body is definitely just the left half. 
That's definitely Jin Furoe. Yeah, the same face we saw six years ago at Studio Divita. Jin was a young industrialist. He was quite famous and often made media appearances. This cannot possibly be a stranger who happens to look like him. Six years ago, Jin Furaway's body was discovered in Studio Devita. And now, his left half was found here at the stadium. And yet his time of death is 12 o'clock today, which means that half his body was alive very recently. <sighs> what the hell is going on? My brain is doing cartwheels trying to figure this out. Iba? Hold on, did Iba just appear? Yeah. Wait, let me put my earphones in. Can you hear me, boss? Yeah, loud and clear. There are no signs of him ever having been frozen. That half-body was definitely alive until just recently. What? I mean, the heart is in the left half of the body. I get it. You think they might have sewn the body back together? No, there are no traces of that. And... Were you two being serious? You do realize the cerebrum, brainstem, and spinal cord were completely severed in two? I looked into Jin Furoi's family background. Not only did he not have a twin, but there is no record of him ever having siblings. I, of course, did consider it a possibility, but both faces match perfectly. The rest depends on the DNA results. I have no idea what's going on, but this case is definitely connected to the incident six years ago. Which means the half-body case isn't over yet. Hey, Aiba. How much do you know about the HB serial killings? As you know, my knowledge of the case is about the same as yours. Due to the explosion six years ago, I lost all of my memories from a few days before that point. And due to poor connection, I was unable to send or retrieve any backups. What about you, boss? Same for me. Ryuki was the one on the case at the time. I don't know anything other than what he reported. What about the stuff he didn't report? I'm not a psychic. How would I know something that he didn't tell me? Aiba, where is Ryuki now? I've determined the location from Toma's GPS. Currently, Ryuki seems to be in Golden Yokocho.
see. Worried about money? Huh? Do you really even have any worries? Is that so? What? Are you bored? Are you kidding me? Indeed. Perhaps it is fair to say life is about doing things to cure boredom. You don't seem to have too many worries. Your life seems fun. Keep at it. Live life like that. If you have any concerns, you could come back here. But you do not have to. You can consult a specialist. This feature prevents me from being bored as well. I appreciate spending time. good in anything, so it feels I have turned to the dark side. I saw Boss buying this earlier. Are we going to match? This is my face when I saw Mizuki solving a disentanglement puzzle with her monstrous strength. This is apparently their reaction when they found out Abyss washrooms are getting bidets. Why do people want to go to a Tommy that badly? It feels like I'm on a date at a summer festival, though it is only February. I have turned. I saw. I have turned to the dark side. <laughs> it feels like I'm on a date at a summer festival. If it looks good on Tama, it'll look good on me. Modern sharks can appear anywhere, land, sea, or air. This mask makes me want to escape within nine hours. If it looks good on Tama... It feels if it looks good.